It's just what it is. Let's uh, go down river real quick and ward over chickens. I want to know if we're getting cheese. Right, go, no, 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 no. Uh, who's chickens? Who's chickens? If would I want to ward there? Think about what you were just going to do. Okay. Good, good autos back off. Back straight off. You want the minions off of you. You see how they got like six extra autos? It's because you didn't back yeah. off after the trade pulled. Now just slow push. Also, you should be starting um, either W or E on this matchup, not Q. Q doesn't give us any value, okay? Okay. Because you see how your Q is shoving the wave? That's what we don't want. Card him. Don't let him farm. You have to like get up on this guy. There you go. Constant fakes. It's, you've got to be relentless about it. Shit. Yeah. This is what I was a little worried about. Hecarim's coming. Just keep walking. He's going to get phase rush. It's going to be a bit of a pain, but he has no flash. The graves. Just walk it out, no problem. You may have to flash, yeah. No, uh, Hecarim is... I guess he's... He's kind of scared there. Uh, he got invaded, I think, is what happened. This game's about to get really hard because of this. Yeah. Yeah. This is your fault, though, because you pushed the wave with your Q too fast. I want you to learn from this. This is why it's okay. much better to start with, like, an E or a W. Because at yeah. least if you're pushing the wave, you're not pushing it as fast as you were. So you'd be a bit more productive. We reset here. You just reset and go. Um, I'd probably go just like a dark seal or something. So I'm still trying to snowball. The I mean, you're not really trying to snowball at this point. It's just the only buy that makes sense. You could go Doran's ring, but I, I like Dor I like um dark seal. Get right back to lane. Okay. This is why their picks are really good. Like aggressive jungler with Kassadin is really good because the jungler can like kind of buy him time to to do what he wants. You should you should cue this um, to try to like thin it out because you're not going to be able to touch him with the wave this big. Don't overplay it though. Back straight up. Every time you auto him, look at the cannon. You see that? You see how it's on you? It's because it's, it's basically mad at you that you punched Kassadin in the face with some cards. <laughs> now use your corrupting pot. We got to kill this guy before he backs. So you need to lean on him hard. You need to lean on him. You can kill him, but you got to get up there. Yeah. Even though he's a level ahead. Yes. Uh, don't, don't walk in his face though. <laughs> don't, don't, don't walk in his face like that. You would have killed him, but uh, you gave him an auto attack for free. That was true. Yes. You were fine. You were fine to go ahead and door drink. You were fine to try to win, but yeah. that doesn't mean... Like you're still TF. Walk up on his face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you had stunned him and just kind of autoed him through, you would have won yeah. that easy. But you got okay. too close, yeah. Yeah, that was really aggressive. I didn't need to walk up on him like that too. Should I freeze it? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Try to freeze it. What's going on here? Struggling. It should be stun card, Q, auto. If you're gonna stun him. Every time on the trades. Okay. You got lucky that you picked me for a coach this champion because I spent so much time studying those damn Dopa replays when I made challenger the first time mm -hmm. 
This champion, I know like every fucking matchup. Auto. See that? Did you see that? That's what you need. Yeah. See? That's what you're looking for early levels. The fuck? Use your corrupting pot to stay towards the bottom of the lane. Okay. More back. More back of the tower. You don't even want to show. You can queue these minions at max range, by the way. We shouldn't be losing any minions. Try not to give him these cues for free. You can back off. Every cue that you take is by choice. Like, if he walks up to you, simply back up. It, sometimes you gotta tank him, but I'm just saying that, like, if you don't, there you go. Make him earn his shit like that. Like, there he had to rift walk forward to get you. That's a lot oh, of man. mana for him to do that. Plus, he tanked the tower shot. There you go. That's better. I would just, uh, I'd probably let him push in, dude. Just steal that with, like, your Q or whatever. Nice. Oh, the Graves died. Yeah. I'd try to shove with Q. Yeah. I would try, but be ready to run away if he all ends us. I'm just saying. Use your swap to your yeah, there you go. Uh blue card it and just Q and back. Do it quick before yeah, I was gonna say. Uh, <laughs> you gotta do it quick, yeah. Basically, just try not to delay on any action. Like when we're gonna yeah. shove, just pull if you pull the blue and Q the wave and back behind the tower, you're never dying. That's fine to go for that. Alternator, go. You play cast in it at all? Oh uh, yeah, I actually do play a lot of cast in. We're gonna like do I... lane. We're gonna do lane practice after this, so I can show you. Okay, cool. And give you more of a, a feeling for how it goes. The thing is, it's hard to really know if you, you know, if you don't play him. I would shove, a shove, shove, shove. So we have a play. I don't want to get shit on under tower anymore. I want to try to get on map yeah. so we can maybe do something. All right. Run straight along the wall, along the wall and down. Camera forward, camera forward to bottom, camera forward to bottom, camera forward to bottom. If you want to know if it's worth roaming, right? Yep. I don't think it is. Stay in the brush. Yep. Okay, Graves is top side. So Kasten probably pinged us because he backed up. You see that? Yeah, now they're coming up. Yeah. Just walk towards tower. Clear the wave and then try to sneak your way down to bottom again. We're going to play through our bot lane because they're at win con right now. Worry about the wave. You got to clear the wave first, dude. Rules of the road. You're not just going to roam on a, on a wave that's pushed under tower. I would try to shove this if you can. He has no flash and I don't think he has ignite. Pull that card. It's okay. You're going to take damage. Try to cue the wave. You want to cue the wave. I don't really care about him. He's going to hurt us. Like, this is what it is. Cue the whole wave. Not cute. Yeah, perfect. Just walk away. We're fine. Part of the game. Now you can ult and stun card him here and kill him. I don't know why Hecarim is giving up on the play. There it is. I, <laughs> I was oh gonna, I was gonna say like, but if you did it faster, it would have been better. Yeah, it's fine though. Okay, it's nice. a good shutdown. Yeah, at least you got it. Cause you're gonna die in that spot. It's just what. It's just yeah. how it's gonna go. But at least if one of you get the shutdown, it's not the worst thing in the world, right? Yeah. Plus mid is pushed in. Oh, so he loses all those too. Mm -hmm. We're just going to be behind. It's just how it's going to go. What's going on top? Move your camera around. 
Uh, you could maybe rotate if they go crazy. Yeah, I'd rotate oh, over. Yeah, yeah. Maybe they try to dive him or something. Move your camera forward now. <clears throat> wow, that guy is scooting. All right, cool. Just go yeah. back to mid. Careful of casting. Run, run the long way. Long way. Safe way. Safe way. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I was just scared. Yeah. I didn't know if he... Because he could path straight up to you guys. Let's try. Watch uh, whatever's happening in the jungle here. I, well, I think it's over. He's too low. Graze the top. Yeah, just back up. No, no, no. You can't walk up like that. You cannot. He's He's got right. you. Yeah. Uh. You cannot walk up like that. You have to be like farming at max range. What's going on bottom? Tragedy game chat on the first one. Tragedy. Bing. What the fuck was that? Careful. You should never be walking into our range ever. You should be just farming safely. Okay. Reset, reset. You might come up and ult you, I don't know. Maybe he has no ult, so like the Hecarim, so I don't know if I would ult on him. All right, Kasten's probably gonna go to bottom. Let's clear this. All right, Q shove the wave. He's not in lane, so you gotta shove. <clears throat> we gotta try. Or we might die. You might just be hiding in a bush somewhere. But yeah, I figured. Is he even worth flashing here? Mm, maybe. You'd have to do it. You'd have to do it on his R though. Like as he rift walks, you'd have to flash that. Okay. <laughs> um. Uh, spell pen. That's why I said I'd give spell pen boots. The reason I said maybe is because what the hell? He doesn't have the damage. I don't think. Oh wow! Nice try by that guy. Got his flash at least. You're gonna cue the whole wave.
Can we alt to bottom? Hey, we need to look for something to do, not just stand around. Go quickly. I would go quickly. We're losing anyways. Yep, go. You saw him. Go. Oh, nice. Careful, Cassidy. Yeah. I would linger right here for a second. I think he's coming bottom. I'd stay right here. Walk along the wall. Behind your team. Yeah, there you go. Just wait in the brush. You have stun. Yeah, wait in the brush. You see him coming. You got a stun card. You're going to pull it. And when he shows up, you're going to stun him and ignite, okay? Okay. Ping on the way. It, like, ping in the lane. Like, on the way. In the lane. Save your stun card for Kassadin. Just wait. Now go for Kassadin. Go. Ignite him. Ignite him. See? You got to set that up because now you need to run. Run and reset. Fuck mid, dude. <laughs> oh, God. Ugh. Oh, shit. Let's go. Hecarim's going through it, chat. Joan, thanks for the three months, guys. We're at 689. <laughs> Let's see if we can hit 690 today. Let's see if we can hit 700, actually. That'd be amazing. That'd be a new milestone. Stay mid, stay mid. Keep pushing mid. If he's going to give you a push, like we're going to take it because he's going to go kill your team and you can't stop him, right? Mm. I queue this wave. Yeah. Now back up, back up and assess, dude. We're not going to push deep. There's casting on you. Yeah. I walk away. You've got, you got a proto belt. There you go. Use your corrupting pot. What about tower here? Wow. Yeah. They use rift on it. That's why you have to back straight up and start moving. Don't just stand around. If you're going to just stand in lane, back up and go somewhere else. Yeah, we can work top for a bit. <clears throat> I mean, we're basically just going to try to steal farm and leave because this guy's just going to rift walk on our head. Is that a new sub I heard? Jonathan, thanks for being a sub. <laughs> we're at 690 now. Thank you so much. <laughs> Keep pushing. <laughs> Fuck that. If he lets us push, this would be nice. Go shove one more wave. Get up there quickly. You see him mid. You got to cheat. You got to cheat and get yep. it done. You can't wait because he's going to path to you. Now, cue it. You need to hurry. Like, you need to cue it. You need to get us out. You need to use red card so it's faster. See, we're, we're already caught. Just ult. Ult right now. I'll just ult. Yeah, just go somewhere. Down the lane. Pick anywhere quickly. Press oh, B. Oh, wow. Yeah. 
I trolled it too and I still got mm -hmm. out. You don't have to aim, uh the fuck. Okay. Reset. Like when you're pushing, dude, you gotta come up with a faster play than what you were doing. Because we can't afford to wait. I'd go to bottom and just hold with uh wave clear. Uh, I don't know where he's going. Oh, no. Go wave clear. Don't worry about top. You're never going there. Just keep pushing out bottom. Yeah, 690 guys. Can we go further? Can it happen? Can we succeed, chat? Keep cruising. Keep cruising bottom. Pull your red card now in advance. There you go. You gotta be doing this quick. Spam your Q. Off cooldown. Don't wait. Just get it done. All right, back. Javin, thank you, bro. <laughs> Did that man take his chat? Wow. Uh, we might get shit on. Flash away, maybe? Yeah, whatever. He doesn't have all. Yeah, he's not going to chase you. Run along the wall. The wall. That way you have a brush to play. There you go. Press B. We're going to... Our only chance to win this game is basically through just splitting and hoping our team wins with Aphilios. It's very unlikely, by the way. I'd sell the Dorn's Ring and get a uh, Blasting Wand. We have a link in the pinned comment you could use too, guys, in chat for subs. Keep pushing forward on bottom. Kassadin is common, brother. Oh, whoops. What the hell is that? All right, wait for the wave. You're going to queue it as it comes in your tower. Okay. We got to get rid of it fast. This is the secret sauce to TF. You got to wave clear this fast. Yeah, you're ready to queue it again. Well. Carl's well. keeping the stream alive. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate you, man. Just like that, we're at 692 now. Nice, they got him. All right, you need to wait for your next stun card. Do not do not alter anything crazy until you have it. I don't think your team's going to find a play. We can just hold mid. Keep watching, yeah. Keep watching that. I would ult so we could see. There you go. That's a nice ult. He might try to EQ you. <laughs> if you proto belt out of that, you win that without dying. You had it. Wow. Yeah, you're right. I didn't even use it. The EQ, the EQ can be blocked by the proto belt. Well, not blocked, but dodged. You play very well. you play Mario, very well. keeping it high. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Super Mario. Two ninety-three. What kind of exclusive content do you get for subs? Well, <clears throat> right now you get all the stickers that I have, and then um, the other thing is at a thousand subs, if I hit that goal, I'm gonna start streaming the private coachings on Facebook to subs only. So all the more reason. You could have, yeah. I was gonna say you might be able to kill him sometimes. Careful, you're gonna step on shroom. Throw a Q. Throw a Q. You're too nice. You're too friendly. Ryan, thank you. 
And yes, you get access to the macro mansion. Private page. If we do any sub games, I haven't done them in a while, but you're allowed to go to those two. I'd back up and reset, dude. Where are you going? Where do you think oh, you're yeah. going? Yeah, you better uh, heal up. <laughs> Grab a pink. TF reveals... Um, TF reveals uh, pretty much everything with his ult chat. So a Kali Shroud as well. Flux has this. Go to top. Don't split uh, resources here. Go to top. Yeah, this Aphilios is pissed. Wiggle. What the fuck is this hacker I'm doing? Simon, we're at 295, and just like that, the train streak is going. It's crazy how like how fast um, early game happened, like uh, with that Q starting to push. I'd even. I don't even think about that kind of stuff. Yeah, it's well, it's because Graves and well, Graves invaded your Hecarim and then passed straight to mid, which made mm. things messy. I actually didn't think that he was going to do that because you warded chickens, but generally, generally the invade, because do you know where Hecarim, where Graves invaded? Do you remember? Or did you see it? If you didn't see it, that's another problem. He invaded no, Graves' area. Gra Graves invaded Hecarim's Gromp after he got red buff. Yeah. That's what happened. Simon, Michael, you guys are awesome. <laughs> Give those guys tickets, chat. Four more, we're at 700, which is cray cray, bros. Go ahead and cue this thing. So, like, <clears throat> Graves invaded Hecram's Gromp, which screwed up Hecram's clear, and then went straight to mid, which screwed up your open. So, it just made things messy. He also has Graves in his name, which he could be a smurf. Uh, I mean, he might be bad with what he's doing right now. I don't know what that is. That's a bad play. <laughs> I would back up and... Well, you got to clear this. Use your red. Red should be coming okay. when you're wave clearing, brother. Okay. But yeah, our sub goal now, chat, is, is 1K. That's the big one that I'm excited about. I will literally, I will literally make a checkbox on my, uh, coachings that says like, Hey, are you comfortable with this being streamed to my subscribers only? And I'll start streaming the, the ones that they okay. Like all my private coachings that I get. It's pretty cool. I probably won't interact with chat during those, but it would still be really dope. Be exclusive. I mean, and if you think about it, guys, go ahead and grab a stopwatch here, I think is what I would do. If you guys think about it, there's not many streams that actually give things back to their subs. <laughs> Sounds bad. But it's true. Most don't. Most are just like, thanks for the sub. I'm not doing anything. I would ult this, probably. This Teemo. Ping on the way. Mmm... Yeah, they're not rotating. It's fine. It's a good affiliate assault. You may have to stop watch. We'll see. No. Cool. Let's shove mid. Back up and shove mid. Have you been enjoying Facebook more than Twitch? Uh, not for the first three months, but yeah, since. I've been very happy with Facebook. For the first three months, it was shaky. Then once I built the community up and Facebook cleaned up their game, it's gotten a lot better here. 
Because their chat delay was so bad, I could barely even interact with my community for the first, like, three, three to six months. Keep the whole wave. But you got to understand from Facebook's perspective, it's like a new platform. I'd probably push one more. I'd probably greed for it. Okay. And get Try to get 16. Yeah, use red card, though. You got to move it fast. Back up as soon as you hit 16. Don't overplay this. Just start backing up. Start fading away in case you get caught. See? You see, he was coming bottom. That's what I was just yeah. afraid of. Yeah. He's going to chase behind you. Put a ward behind you. All right. You need a zone with a stun card and wiggle. Jarvan has EQ. Remember, you have Proto Belt. Try to just hold stun cards when you can. They're tanking Dragon. This is actually favorable for you guys. Just let them tank it. It's kind of good that y'all backed off. Timo's also top. If you get this, you will lose top and hit. But if you get this, it's not that bad. Chogaf's mm -hmm. getting too impatient. Yeah. All right, we're done. We're doomed. Get ready for the collapse, brother. The collapse from hell. <laughs> the Cassidy with one billion riff walks a second. Watch him. Oh, uh, damn. No! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's no way of stopping that. Thanks, Casey. Middle ground on engaging with subs could be helpful. I generally try to engage with my subs. You ever drink Bailey's? No. I don't drink. I just can't do it. I have an addictive personality. I don't think it'd be good for me. I've played League since Season 3 out. I'm actually, contrary to popular belief, I have not been playing since beta. I actually am one of the newer streamers in the, in the scheme of things. Like, with the streamers that I came up with, we're all... Um, we're all, uh, like, beta, beta streamers. As well as beta males. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Okay, so I'm going to do... Uh, lane practice with you. We're gonna clean up your auto attacking with TF just general laning You didn't pull off the minions fast enough there. Not enough pressure here. Because you're not going to draw minion aggro until you actually auto me. And that's the one thing you got to watch out for right there. If he hits you with the auto W. Yeah. That's where you get into trouble. Don't let go of your stun card quite so quickly. You can keep walking up. I don't know why you're backing up. Because I'm not going to touch you. Now, once I see you use that stun card, I'm going to. There you go. That was much better. It actually put pressure on me so that I couldn't just do what I wanted for a second.
Now leave real quick. We'll swap roles again. We're going to bounce back and forth. So I could use them to like climb the diamond. Absolutely. You could use both these champions to climb easy. Both these champions are viable. Yeah, I always walk right up. Yeah, like straight at me. It is there is like an aggressive nature to it, you're right. I'm not I notice I just kinda like I have my abilities, but I don't really pressure them to do Yeah, I'm I'm basically trying to find that line based on what you can and can't do, right? I know that you can't do anything about me walking up. Obviously if you get ganked while you're doing this, you might look like a fucking moron. But that's why you kind of plan it out in advance with the ward early. Just think about yeah. what's going on, right? Wow, that actually hit me. The cue at the end. And then in the real game, I'd probably do something like this. Because it feels like just chilling here for no reason, I won't be able to harass you. You see how smooth the patterns are? That's what you're looking for. You see? That? Isn't that nuts? That's yeah. what I'm talking about, though. Like, I'm glad I got to show you it. So the goal is slow push a big wave right and mm -hmm. fucking drill on that guy the whole time <laughs> okay and if I you can a, do that ward, so like while i'm doing that i should be like hugged if i'm that pushed up like in an actual game i should still be hugged to one side right like for ward. yeah you try to figure out yes so like okay. yeah if the jungle like look at my look at where i'm standing so like if mm -hmm. you think the jungler's top side try to cheat it this way right and vice versa um Okay. If you can do it and pr like if you can do that what I just did to you free ride to diamond It's hard though Like what I just did is very hard. It took me a long time And sometimes you can splash the W on minions as well, so try to be creative with it So that you can hit me and the minions one more auto. I don't know how you didn't get electrocute there. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that happens a lot. I'm I, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Probably. Yeah, I don't know. I think it has to be. There it is. I think it has to be just like in a certain rhythm. Mm -hmm. Good. You see how I'm kind of trying to figure out if I can get it safely without taking too much damage. That's what yeah. you're trying to communicate with your laning patterns is like You're trying to prove that you understand like hey if you go for this, it's gonna hurt, right? Should be like a conversation laning We're having a debate over minions, dude. We're discussing minions. <laughs> I say that's interesting way to look at it. Yeah, that's what I say I say every minions in negotiation like when I coach the the lane practice stuff yeah. It's like I'm walking up to the minions and I go, Ooga Booga, can I have this? And you go, Ooga Booga, no, right? And the reason it's Ooga Booga is because, nice, that was good. And the reason it's Ooga Booga is because you obviously can't have the dialogue, right? But it's just your body language and everything. Yeah, you're communicating through it all, how you move yeah. and all that. Yeah. That's fine. That's fine. Shit happens. That's how you learn the line. See, it's a lot of pressure. That was good, though. You played right on that line well. That was the other thing I noticed immediately when I was playing Cassidy was I was getting poked. And you, there were some times where I was like, okay, he's about to take a tower shot, but you didn't. Yeah, because I'm like, wiggling out right as yes. 
This is how you know that I'm not lying about I studied this champion like really fucking hard, bro. Like yeah. I and I know this fucking this matchup. But that's yeah, the thing, so I, like what's up? I was gonna say I used to play a lot of TF like uh, a few years ago when I played. Um I stopped and then my roommate told me that you were uh, used to play a lot of TF and you got on the got the challenger with them. So I was like, okay, I'll try that on the Yeah, it's very technical. Very technical. And then here, I would probably in a real game, if the game drags like this, I would try to, I mean, if you can slow push a wave in by all means, like if you can push one, like one more wave in, but if it ever gets to a point where you're like, I'm not sure if I can ever kill this guy, yeah. you want to try to like shove and back and just accept that he, you know, he got through the early, right? Without dying. Like right here, I'd back in a real game. Okay. And you just kind of go, oh, well, he played it well, right? Like, he didn't, he didn't, uh, just int it. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to ooga booga at you. Your, uh, your rhythm of auto attacking and, and harassing has gotten a lot better since we started doing this. Because now you're actually like threatening real trades as opposed to before to where you weren't really sure about how to combo it, right? Mm -hmm. And that was the the mana right now is why you'd reset. Okay. It's because if you're in this position, there's just no way that uh that it would be possible. Yeah, I, I started running like teleport a lot more um, mm -hmm. just because of the, the mana issues. I, yeah, just anything in case I'm like that. I get really low, take a lot of harass. I can like safely back and, sit, and not like have a. So yeah, have, teleport's like, a bit of a crutch in these types of matchups though, because you can see now that it's exploitable matchup if you know what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Yeah, that, that uh, E, f or it's like R flash. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that R flash combo and casting looks so mean, dude. It's like, wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> All right, I gotta go, dude. I'm gonna coach your roommate. Okay, cool. I'll watch it. Uh, thank you. Yeah, man. Keep uh, keep grinding him. Um, I mean, I don't play a lot of TF lately. I don't know mm -hmm. if um, if you can find Dopa's like uh, it's I think it's called. Hoyu, Doyu, something like that. It's whatever the stream is. He plays a yeah. ton of TF. Uh, he's basically the guy that I studied for. I literally, I swear to God, I comb. I must have combed through like 50 of his games um, when I was first trying to break into Challenger with it because uh, I really just wanted to understand like why is this guy so like I knew I had mechanics, I guess mechanic ish, but like I didn't know why he was winning all the time and like all the matchups like i couldn't understand it until i studied it and then like i told you today that's what i just coached you is basically how is what i learned through watching him okay like there was no explanation like no one really taught me like oh you need to you know you need to win this matchup like i just looked at his runes and i noticed every time he had a melee matchup it was like he always went ignite and like electrocute and i'm like huh i thought you just played like a bitch in those you know what i mean yeah yeah, exactly. That's what you would think. That's what yeah. I would thought. You still can. Like, there's plenty of pros that play that way, but I don't think mm -hmm. it's optimal for, like, carrying. And he's, you know, he's just a really good player at climbing. So he yeah. he does... Basically, it's, like, it's limit test, right? He plays right to the line, even on a matchup like that, where, you know, it seems scary, but if you saw it, like, if you're playing it correctly, there's really nothing that can be done. It wins. Like, the TF is winning yeah. the lane, like, the early. That stop that would be, like, some dumb cheese where they, like... Yeah, Jarvan nowhere. level two, Jarvan level two, or whatever, right? Some, yeah. or like a gank that you're not really accounting for. Cool. All right, man. GG. Thank you so much.